figured we'd sit down with Ian and ask him a few questions. It's always nice. Not too many people get the opportunity to pick the brain of a professional athlete. What about baseball kind of got you into it in the beginning? Like what was... Uh, I started at four years old, so <laughs> kind of nice. just even before that, I guess I would just pick up a ball and or an object and just chuck it around my house as a yeah. kid. So <laughs> my parents were like, we should put that arm to use. Yeah, exactly. Uh, <laughs> so yeah, I played pretty much from T-ball all the way up through high school and then got drafted out of high school and been playing ever since. Nice. Did you know in high school, like, hey, this is what I want to do? Like, obviously you get to a certain level when you're 12, 13, 14, you're starting to take it more serious, probably doing some travel ball. Yeah. Um, you know, you're seeing your game improve. Like, at what age did you go, yes, I want to go pro? As a kid, you always have the dream, like, yeah, yeah. I want to be in the MLB. And then, yeah, as I got older, around that age, travel ball started to come into the mixture. And, you know, my mom started to, I think at one point I was on four different teams. Jeez. When I was maybe like 13 <laughs> or 14. Yeah. I'd be two normal, like, Babe Ruth and Little League teams. And I'd do travel ball and I'd do, um another travel ball team but yeah once you start getting around to the high school level you start hearing guys getting committed to schools and then that becomes your pursuit and i think i committed to ucf maybe my junior year okay. going into my junior year that summer prior and after that happens you kind of go okay well what's next yeah. and then you start to play better and you start to see more of the the game start to work out in your favor so you start to go well maybe i can be a professional yeah and then teams start to contact you. So kind of just a little seed gets planted in your head. Yeah. Like, I think I can do this. Yeah. And I think that really helped me have that drive when I was in high school to always want to get better, always want to be on the mound, always want to be in the gym doing stuff, trying to just always get better and yeah. it worked out. So. That's perfect. Walk us through that day, like getting the call to get drafted. Like how special is that? Again, we see it all on TV. We see the guys, you know, get excited and get, yeah. when they get drafted, like, that's got to be a special moment. Yeah, yeah. So I think uh, the draft is normally maybe well, it's the first, first one and two rounds, yeah. typically on televised. Yeah. And then rounds three through ten, I think we're on MLB Network. So I already knew I was going to be the second day. Um, pretty much just waited by the phone with my parents, and you know my agent was in contact with me the whole day. But it's funny because I was in the back room talking on the phone with the Braves, and I hear from the living room like a bunch of cheering yeah and my uh parents come in and they're like hey you just got taken by the cardinals fifth round and i was like sorry i gotta go yeah. so i hung up on the guy hung up on the braves but i ended hey. up calling him back or texting him back and yeah. i was like hey sorry he's like no i totally get it go have fun with your family but yeah yeah it's funny because you things happen so fast in situations like that when you got drafted by the cardinals what was your kind of progression to the point maybe not necessarily up to the point you're at now but like did they meet your expectations where were you were you expecting to get to a certain uh, level in the first yeah, couple of years? Yeah, the Cardinals were good. They taught me a lot. I, I came from a high school that was very disciplined, um, a lot of structure, a lot of rules. Taught me, you know, what not to do and what to do. And the Cardinals were pretty similar. They're a very traditional organization, yeah. and I think they gave me a really good opportunity. Uh, ended up not working out with them. I was with them for six years. Okay. Got up to yeah. double A with them. From the Cardinals. So from the Cardinals, um, I went them for six years and then I went to independent league in the okay. American Association. Had a really good year. Uh, ended up getting picked up by the Mariners for 2019, 2020, 2021, and 2022. Okay. And then ended up getting released from them in AAA midway through the year and ended up in Gastonia. And that's currently where I'm at being a starter again as well as a pitching coach. Just work hard, be convicted in what you do, and be a good teammate and a good leader on the field. 